Welcome to the Microfiles. I'm Hamilton Pevick. Please click the subscribe button and like and comment to validate my existence. To cut or pluck has been a debate for what feels like centuries. Wholehearted vitriol has been expressed on both sides of this endless debate, and tonight we will end the discussion until some noob reignites the fire. Underneath that simple question lies a bigger, darker one for mycophiles to ask, is collecting mushrooms sustainable? In 2012, Fungi Magazine, Volume 5-1, the spring issue, an article titled Agricidal Tendencies, Settling the Debate Over Cutting Versus Picking, and the Sustainability of Wild Mushroom Collecting, author Britt A. Bunyard lays the debate to rest, quote, turns out that it doesn't much matter, end quote. Since its inception in 1986, the Cantharellis Project has surveyed 10 plots of chanterelle mushrooms growing in the Mount Hood National Forest in Oregon. The Cantharellis Project collects statistics on plots that are harvested by cutting all mushrooms with a knife and plots harvested solely by pulling the mushrooms from the soil. Turns out that in the cut plots, yields have decreased, but only very slightly over time. In plots harvested by simply pulling out the mushrooms, yields have actually gone up during the 25 years of this study. A 2006 study authored by Simone Egli et Alia, simply referred to as the Swiss study, the researchers involved in the Swiss study said cutting with a knife may do more harm than good because it leaves a severed stump of the mushroom, which can become a site of infection by pathogens of mushrooms like bacteria and other fungi. Research has shown that, as with nearly all other wildlife, the most serious threat to mushrooms and other fungi comes from habitat loss, i.e. humans. As a caveat to this story, it's important to mention that the Cantharellis Project did some amazing science. As part of the study, every single chanterelle mushroom is harvested across 10 different patches from 1986 to 1997, each mushroom's position within the plot was recorded and all specimens were dried, vouchered, and kept for future research. That is a shameful amount of uneaten chanterelles and some super hardcore sciencing. Excellent use of willpower. Go team!